We hear that our economies have to keep growing and growing, but we know that in nature, growth eventually stops. What are you two doing? Well, you stopped growing. I thought growth was supposed to be infinite. There's an obsession in economics with growth. We're told that our economies have to keep growing and growing and growing. We know that growth requires natural resources, which are limited. It makes no sense to believe that we can just keep on growing. In fact, the only thing in nature that grows indefinitely is cancer. What's wrong? I have cancer. Cancer? That's great! Don't you know what cancer is? The cells keep growing and growing out of control. Infinite growth! That's just what we want in this economy! Economic growth is measured in terms of GDP. But as we know, GDP is all about production. How do we have production? By taking natural resources and turning them into something else. Well, eventually, guess what happens? Our natural resources are going to run out. We're not leaving any for future generations. And how do economists respond to this problem? By denying it. Mainstream economists claim to be very concerned about poverty. They say the problem of poverty is that there's not enough wealth to go around. So what's the answer? Create more wealth. Bake a bigger pie. When we have more, they claim, everybody will finally get enough. It's just one small problem with that. If the rich continue to take the lion's share, the poor will never get enough. Do you want some cake? Yes! Okay. about growth of positive things, that makes sense. So we need to measure the stuff that we value. We have to stop being happy about growth of things that hurt us. Only then, when we look at what really matters to make people better off and to ensure that that growth or the benefits are being spread across the population, then we can get to a better place. It's not about more of the stuff that hurts us, it's about enough of the stuff we need and it being shared amongst us all.